Hello everyone, Pixwitch here and welcome back to my Belladonna Cove Let's Play series. We're back with the Patel family. It is 5am, Anna is getting up and I assume she is about to pop. So we're going to have our first birth here in Belladonna Cove and I am so excited for it. So let's go and unpause and see what will happen. Will we get a boy? Will we get a girl? And there we go. It is a lift off. And I spend so much time looking for names. And I believe it's a girl. I believe it is a girl. Okay, so Anna's been given an additional three days off in order to give the newborn all the attention it deserves and needs. So the new baby has arrived and this bouncing baby needs a name and it's a baby girl. So as I said, I have been looking for names and it took me a while and really that is the reason why it has taken me a while to actually get to recording this episode. But I have two girl names, I have two boy names and the third first name I'm gonna use is going to be Charu. So Charu means pretty, pleasant, beautiful, loved, cherished. And that is how we spell it. Charu. Pretty, pleasant, beautiful. So we're gonna go with that for our first child. Okay, so we just had the first birth. Charu is in her mother's arms and then her dad decided to go and brush his teeth. But I'm going to tell him to stop with that. And then, darling, can you go and look at your child, please? <laughs> okay, so Anna put Shadow in the crib, and then Ramir. You do want to serve food, that is excellent, so you can go and do that. But first, you can go and tidy up this plate because I could hear all the flies buzzing around. So what are you going to serve? You're going to serve breakfast. How about we just go with llama O's? So Rami is going to serve that. He's going to tidy up the plates, the dirty dishes. But here's a close-up of Charu. I love her skin. Look at all the freckles. She is so beautiful. And then also I'm using the default replacements for the diaper. So I chose this color, this dark purple, I believe it's aubergine, I chose that for a girl, and then for the boy I chose a bluish color, it was called ocean, but I'll include the link to the default replacements in the description box down below, so if you are curious, if you want to get it for yourself, then yeah, the link will be there for you. But now it is super important for mum and dad to get ready for the day, but she wants to study about parenting, yes, I'm gonna lock that in. She does want to go and kiss Ramir. I want to do that, so we're going to send her downstairs. Uh, while Ramir tidies up and makes breakfast, I'm going to have her use that. So I see that Ramir wants to have a good reputation, so I'm gonna lock that one in as well. So right now he wants to have a friend and have a good reputation, and I really feel that both are really important for him. So I'm going to lock in have a good reputation. So Anna used the bathroom, the breakfast is ready, and now Anna wants to kiss him, so I'm going to have her give him a romantic kiss. And now, I'm so curious, yeah, what will she roll? So now she wants to flirt. Maybe she already wants to start working on baby number two. We'll see what will happen. And now she wants to classic dance with him. Classic dance, there we go. So they're sitting down for a quick family breakfast. Ramir should actually leave for work soon, but he also needs to go and use the bathroom. So I will go and send him upstairs to go and do that. And then we will be alone with Anna and Charu for the day. And Anna is coming upstairs automatically, so let's see what she will do. I also put in this um, little fridge over here, four minute fridge. I thought that would be really, really helpful for the new parents. Oh really? You're gonna go downstairs? Really? I'm gonna stop you. Feed bottle to Charu. There we go. <laughs> I put that fridge in for you to make your life easier.
Also, this is something I nearly forgot to speak about, but the nursery walls are blue with yellow stars, so we could assume that Ramir wanted a boy, or that Anna really wanted to give Ramir a boy because he wanted an heir. And with certain people, the heir is really a boy, it has to be a male heir. So we could say that they were hoping for a boy, then maybe part of Ramir is disappointed, but we will see if. Ramir will have interests in common with Jaru and we know that Anna will, would want to have more children so at the end of the day we could go and decide that the heir will be the child who Ramir really gets along with. We can decide that the child he gets along with, but also the child who has interest in politics. So that could happen. And also I've added the Bouncy Nator and the Dangle Master, and I love both items so much, especially the animations. Isn't that so cute? But I don't want to leave the babies in the Bouncy Nator and the Dangle Master for like hours on end. I do want to put the baby in the crib again. So Anna is getting a little hungry and I think I want her to go and prepare some more food because Anna and Ramir will be busy with Jaru, they will be exhausted and then they will have to probably take turns and so on. How about stuffed peppers? What is her? Okay, she has four points and they have the smoke alarm. <laughs> Okay, we are set, I believe. I see that Anna wants to go fishing, she wants to gain a cooking skill point, and she wants to talk to Ramir. And then I think when she's done preparing the food and done eating, then I'm going to put Charu in the crib because I don't want the babies to go and sit in the bouncy nighter or lie by the dangle master for hours on end. It's kind of like with that, um, quilt bed blanket that I gave for, that I bought for Etsu. I don't want to leave the toddler in, on the blanket for hours on end, like that, during the night, during the night. I'm fine with it during the day, but I don't want to do that again during the night. I wrote about that in one of the blog posts for the show ladies around. I can't remember which blog post it was for, maybe 3.3? But my issue with the three items, the Bouncy Nator, the Dangle Master, the Blanket, is this. They are too helpful and they make gameplay way too easy. But then Anna, you can put this away as single plates. And then I think she can probably go and sleep a little bit. And we will see how Ramir will interact with Charu. But I am excited for more children. But both ladies are in bed, busy sleeping. And then I was speaking about more babies. And really I am excited for more Patel babies. Because Ramir wants to create a political dynasty. And I can really see the mayor of Belladonna Cove being a Patel. Like, most of the time a Patel will be the mayor of Belladonna Cove. But I also had an idea with the other family in Belladonna Cove that one of the members of that family will be a cult leader. Like, most of the time a member of that family will be a cult leader. And you might guess which family that will be. But I really love the idea that Patel will be a mayor. Like it's not always guaranteed but Patel will be a mayor and then a different family that one of the family members will always be a cult leader. So I really like that idea. And then also about the blog post for this episode. I'm not going to say that much about it over here but I made a decision about the apartment residence. But if you're curious about that, about about a decision that I've made about the apartment residence and so on and you can read about it in the blog post but I will speak about it in the future in this series so if you don't have the time to read the blog post then it's fine I will speak about it later okay so you can go and put her back in the crib see if she wants to go and sleep a bit more perhaps 
Oops. But she also wants to talk with Ramir, so he can also go and do that, and then see what she will roll afterwards. And then she can go and use the toilet. Her hygiene is okay. And then Ramir is home now, and then she needs to have some fun. So let's have her go and speak with Ramir. Oh, yes. <laughs> But he wants to talk about Harvey. He wants to cook again. Now, I interpret this to mean that Ramiro knows that they are going to be super busy and they won't always be able to cook. I really see him as a non-traditional guy because some people, some men feel that cooking is the woman's job. Because I said that perhaps he's non-traditional, maybe he'll be fine with Charo being his heir. But once again, I really want his heir to be the child he gets along with really well and also the child who has an interest in politics. I do know that there are magazines that can boost a sim's interest in a topic but I haven't looked at those magazines in a long time so I will look into that. That's also an idea but Rami is home right now. He needs to go and shower. And then also while we are in the bathroom I changed the bathtub. So I had this one the Aqua Plus shower stall but I replaced it with this one. It is the backless version of the shower but I just felt that wall was just way too big and it can also get into the way so I replaced that bathtub shower combo. Before I forget, Ramir is already past the fifth level in the politics career. He doesn't have the career reward. This item over here, the teleprompter, he doesn't have it. So I can go and give it to him. I'm not sure where exactly we're going to put it. We could go and put it over here, but there isn't really that much space for it. When they do get the family home, I would like him to have a nice office. And then he can use that. So maybe I could go and give him the career reward. But then I will simply put it in his inventory. So unlock career objects. He is in the political career. So we're going to unlock that career reward. And there we go. And then we are going to delete that. I'm going to put that over there. Okay, so Anna changed into her every day. I thought that it was time for her to change because she was in her sleepwear most of the time. Ramir wants to go and kiss her, so let's go and smooch her and then see what will happen. Okay, now they want to go and talk to each other. Not that, so talk a chat. <laughs> Now you want to play, and then you want to tell Joe and play. So, play tickle. And I can also hear that there's a dirty plate that needs to be cleaned up. It's probably from Anna's lunch. She wants to appreciate, tell joke, so entertain joke and appreciate. Groom. Okay, so Chara's birthday is only a day away. It seems like only yesterday that the little bundle of joy came into this world. Oh, how quickly they grow up. Yes, indeed. Entertain a joke. <laughs> how should we interpret that? Maybe he's in the mood for something else, but he's not rolling that. Play with Anna, he also wants to talk about hobby. And now he wants to go and clean. Yeah, you, you are just like halfway. Dude, she wants to entertain the little joke. They really just want to joke around. I thought that you guys would want to go and work on maybe number two. Okay, and then really tell the joke, tickle. <sighs> tell dirty joke. Okay. She is getting a bit tired. She still needs some more fun. Charu is still fine. He wants to play. So let's go and tickle real quick. Okay, is are you guys going to go and roll any romantic ones? Any at all? <laughs> they just want to joke with each other. Let's just go and appreciate it. Maya, just one last thing and then let's see if she will roll anything different. Nope. So I thought that we would look at Anna's one true hobby, but apparently she already knows that it's tinkering. I didn't notice the pop-up. 
imagined here that uh, you know the jingle when they realize oh this is really wonderful i really like this activity i really honestly didn't notice that but apparently tinkering is her one true hobby so that is something that she and ramir can go and do together but she needs some fun charu is still fine at the moment uh let's see let's see children family fun i guess and then ramir you wanted to go and clean that actually you can go and where is it macro clean you can go and do that because you wanted to clean up earlier so you can go and do that for us you're really sweet thank you but yes i just have really friendly ones for each other i was hoping that after they fulfilled the ones to kiss each other that yes they would go and get other type of ones Ramir wants to have a friend. Let's see if there's a neighbor outside. Yes, there is. There is Richard Rogers. Actually, I want you to stop that. Did you tidy this up? No, you didn't. So I want you to clean that up. And then you can go and talk, chat with Richard Rogers. Because you do want a friend. So we can go and do that. And then Anna, dearest, your fun meter is fine and then you can go and have leftovers i would say and then you can go and sleep as well so ramir is outside busy working on a new relationship with mr richard rogers i wonder how many richards there are in this neighborhood but they seem to be getting along so far bonding about coffee and working hard and so on uh, let's go and joke and then talk about hobby he did have that want earlier he doesn't want it right now but we can still have him do it and then anna are you into bed charu still still seems fine the charu hasn't had a bottle in hours now ramir could go and take care of that so how is this going so far 39 talking about the supernatural about bats about finding treasures overseas treasure hunting but ramir and richard rogers they do seem to be getting along so far so i sent ramir inside he's going to go and give charu a bottle because i imagine it has been a while and then the relationship richard rogers that is 45 over four and that is just in how long an hour a few hours that is wonderful so hopefully tomorrow then ramir can go and spend some more time with that and it's nearly 3 a.m. Little Charu needs her diaper to be changed. So Anna, you can get up, go and take care of her. Okay, now she wants to learn fire prevention, learn anger management. But I definitely want her to study about parenting. So it is 4.30 in the morning. I'm going to have Anna use the bathroom. And it's also raining, so I have to get in really, really close. Otherwise, we're gonna see the rain. Oh my dear, there's a storm outside. And also about her wants to become friends with Connor. She has one bottle of chemistry for him. And they really did get along. She could go and call him early in the morning just to have a friendly conversation with him. Okay, so Anna's busy studying parenting. Ramir is nearly done with the bathroom. Room. He does want to go and talk about hobby, have a party, serve food, go fishing and so on. And then we could have him go and serve some more food once again just to make sure that they have more than enough food prepared. Okay, so Rami's bank deposit account has gained interest of 1,200 simoleons. That is excellent. And I'm pretty sure he's going to go outside, so I'm going to stop him. Okay, and now he wants to go and eat it. So grab a plate. No. <laughs> okay, if you want to go and sit outside in a storm. Okay. So yeah, he is eating his breakfast in the middle of a storm. Doesn't care that it is raining. <laughs> there we go. I wanted to see his feet. What is he thinking about? Best friends. Okay. And now I see he has the one to go and kiss Anna. So yes, 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 yes. Okay, now he wants to flirt with her. So, flirt, caress. 
couple will arrive for Anna. Classic dance. Uh, let's see, dance classic. Couple will arrive. Would you want to go to work? I think I'm going to have her use the vacation day so that she can stay at home and then she can hopefully finish this. Spend some more time with Charu. So I think I'm gonna do that now. Have her use her vacation day. So I had Anna call in sick so that we could keep her one vacation day. And then now I'm gonna see if Connor's home, see if they can just talk and develop the friendship. But I'm honestly curious if Anna will meet someone she has really nice chemistry with because she has one belt for Anna, one for Ramir, one for Carlos, and then one for Joe. And then look at little Char busy playing over there. Oh, I love that animation. But I also want Anna to go and speak to her female neighbor, Judith. I want to see if she will get along with her because she also needs some female friendship. And I think it will be easy, really easy for Anna to go and make a friend with someone in the apartment. Rather, it would be useful because they're really close to each other. There we go, she and Connor are now friends. She fulfilled that and now she wants to become best friends with him. She also wants to gain a skill point, but... Oh yeah, she is hungry. But she needs to eat something and then I want her to work on the parenting skill. I want to make sure that she can hopefully get that today. So I'm having Anna go over here, introduce herself to the neighbor. And this is Judith Baker, her one female neighbor. So I'm just having her go and meet Judith. Just want to make sure that they know each other because then I can start a friendship. Hopefully they will be able to start a friendship so they can just go and talk. I'm gonna send Anna back to her own apartment soon. And then, yeah, like I said, hopefully she will be able to work a bit more on the parenting skill. And I really want her to fulfill that because she's a feminism and I can really see her wanting to read as many books as she could, as she can. And then also I would like to give the apartment residents over here makeovers, especially Judith. I think Richard Rogers is okay. But I see Judith as a young, recent graduate. So I think I'm going to have Anna put Charu in the crib. Or maybe we can just keep Charu here because she will age up soon. So I think we can just leave her there. And yeah, I, I didn't want to leave Charu in the Dangle Master for hours on end, but we're really close to her birthday. Like Anna would have to put Charu in the crib, go and study her book, and then she would have to go upstairs again. So now Charu would be close by. And also, I'm okay with this because Anna is sitting right over there on the bench. And I didn't like having it to sleep on that blanket during the night all alone so i decided not to do that again i spoke about that in the blog post i mentioned that earlier but yes that was a choice that i made that the toddler will not be able to sleep all night on that blanket He brought with pizza, so I am going to say that this means that they're not going to throw a party, that they're just going to be mum, dad, and then a daughter today, and then some other day they can go and throw a party. But Ramir is like, let's just have some pizza, then have a really laid back evening. <laughs> so Ramir just fed Charu a bottle. And then this was after he had a pizza slice, but now he popped. Yeah, he's really, really not fit. We do have that exercise machine, but go and dispose of that. And then also it is near 6 p.m. It still has the ones to go and kiss Anna. I'm really hoping that they will roll some more different romance ones for each other. So I also see that Connor Weir is calling for Ramir and then Ramir decided to go and answer the phone. And Anna did want to go and help Charu with her birthday, but now she's just holding her. And now he has the ones to get fit, make a friend, get fit. It. He is close to becoming friends with Richard. And then also, are you gonna age her up now? Yes, please go and age her up. 
<gasps> there we go. I really love this flying baby. And there she is, toddler Charu. Charu just grew up from a baby to a toddler. She's so cute. I can't wait to see her as a child and then as a teen and so on. I'm also so curious. Will she want to go to university and so on? So she is between sloppy and neat. She has nine points in outgoing. She is active, has seven points. She is serious and she is nice. So the only difference is that she is really, really outgoing. She still has, yeah, I really, oh. <laughs> have a baby yes yes but i also wanted to study parenting i really wanted to finish that okay but we also need to go and get her a potty i'm just gonna put it down over there so that ramir can go and take her real quick to the potty and then anna i want you to go and study parenting and then ramir it is nearly 7 30 i want him to go outside Oh, he became friends with Charo, so he fulfilled that. But he does want to go and be friends with Richard. And then, uh, let's see. I think maybe with some exercise he'll get fit once again. Okay, so now that Ramir is bathing Charo, let's look at her personality. She's an Aries. Her interest, she has 7 in entertainment, 8 in sports, 8 paranormal, 9 animals. And then 7 toys she's closer with her mum than with her dad and then her wants she wants to learn to talk learn to walk and then she has wants for anna be tickled by anna and then be read to by anna i just have to get up close because of this so look at what she's wearing and dad is holding her up and they are getting close i'm happy to see that so I had Ramir pull out a toy out of the toy chest and Ramir needs some fun. It is 9pm. He does want to be friends with Richard Rogers. And then Anna should be done with the parenting skill soon. And I see Richard Rogers is outside. So why don't you guys talk, chat and then entertain, joke. How about you admire him? And then Charu will be in her little bedroom. Her needs are like really really great right now so she'll be fine for a while and ramir is going outside to hopefully forge a friendship of richard rogers and then now hopefully anna will be able to fulfill this study about parenting excellent and now let's see she wants to teach jara to talk learn to talk or learn to walk i think we can lock in learn to walk and then learn to walk over there Maybe we can send Anna upstairs and then she can work on the that, teaching Charu to walk. I'm not gonna make uh, smart milk right now because Anna is really tired. And I also see someone caught some butterflies but didn't release them so they all did. And then Anna is gonna just eat some pizza and then I want her to work with Charu for a little bit. Does she have work tomorrow? Uh, yes she does, yes she does. Okay, are they friends yet? Should be soon. I'm gonna lock that in because hopefully we'll fulfill that one soon. Yes, he did. Okay, so Ramir is getting ready for bed and then now Anna is going to go and work for a little bit with Miss Charu. Just for a bit because she is, well Anna, Anna is really tired, Charu is also getting a little tired. But she's just gonna work for a little bit on this want. But I'm really happy that Anna has this want. I'm not gonna lock it in just yet. Anna and Ramir haven't rolled any wants for wooing. But after kissing and flirting, then Anna and Ramir really don't have any other wants for each other. But I could interpret this to mean that because she wants to have a baby, she's going to just tell him, look, I want to have another baby. How about we try? Maybe it could be something like that. So everyone is in bed. Charu will become a child in four days. That will be in the next round. But we will see what will happen with this one. But right now, Anna really wants to focus on Charu. So I will leave this episode over here. Thank you so much everyone for watching. I really appreciate it. So until next time, take care. Big switch out.